what is going on guys today i want to go over something that a lot of people have complained about uh, about the icloud unlocked devices so a lot of people have been saying that you can't sign into the app store you can't download apps what's the point but that's actually not true you can download apps it's just a little more difficult than you're usually used to so you're going to want to head over to the app store and click the top right profile icon and you're going to want to log into your icloud account so if you pay attention here i download that app right now and there's about a five minute uh difference between here and the end so that is the app that's actually going to install but i had to keep going and checking and you can see that my icloud account is actually logged in uh, on the top there i tried to download linkedin i tried to download numerous amounts of apps and only that app uh was installed so things that i find that actually help you download the apps are when you head over to uh, your profile on the app store and you head over to the purchased uh, section and you download an app that you have already downloaded previously on another iDevice those tend to download a lot easier than the other apps but as you can see i tried downloading linkedin no luck i tried downloading a few apps no luck um, but if you wait, if you bear with me for a few more seconds, you're going to see that the first app that I actually tried downloading is currently downloading. And it did take quite a while to get it to work. Uh, it took around five minutes, which is not a big deal considering that um, you're taking a phone that was activation locked, unusable, and you're making it usable. So now you can see that this app is actually downloading. Um, after about the third or fourth try, it is downloading and it does complete and I am able to boot the app later uh, after this some of the other apps began to download the thing is you just have to be patient if you're not patient um, it can be a bit frustrating but the apps do download they just take a bit of time so one more thing I just want to show you guys uh, this bypass does allow you to restart the device and once you restart the device uh, this doesn't happen all the time sometimes it will go back to the activation lock but for the most part when you restart a device uh, with this bypass it actually stays activated so you don't have to keep bypassing over and over and over again um, i find that on the higher versions of software uh, they do not stay bypassed but on ios 12 um, they do stay bypassed anyway thank you guys for watching let me know if you have any questions below uh, I'll try and answer as many as possible. Thank you and have a great day.